Hey everybody, this is Alvin Brown, CEO and founder of the Center for Healing and P-Performance and Integrated P-Performance Services. I'm also the author of Journey of Personal Greatness, Mind, Body, and Soul, a blueprint for life balance and self-mastery, available at all your major bookstores in, in the US, Amazon, Barnes & Noble, Books A Million, in Canada, Chapters Indigo, check it out, pick one up. Also, the journal, the Journey of Personal Greatness journal. I don't care if you take this journal, any journal, I want you to get a journal. A journal enables you to rise above your situation and take a look at it from a 40,000 foot view so you don't get overwhelmed and so you don't get consumed by it. I have a client who was able to look back at how all her patterns and realize that that was it. That was my pattern and I have to change that. But without doing that, we run on a treadmill all the time and we don't stop to look. And we keep making the same errors in our ways and still living out the same reality. So journal is hugely important. I'm a big one on that. All right, so this is Soulful Saturday. Our topic today, ironically, I wanna talk about rise above your problems. This is a couple key points, focus points. Overwhelmed, we are energy, and some action points. I want this to not just talk at you. I wanna, I'm hoping that you use this information and help your, just one key to your lock will help turn it around and I'm hoping that if I keep preaching, you will somehow hear that word and change and, and add it to what you need to change to go for your personal greatness. All right, so the action steps. Accept your situation, but don't become it. And number two, watch your labels. All right, let's start with number one, overwhelmed. All right, when we're in a situation, any situation, our problems, we can often get consumed by it and it just overwhelms us and we can't, we're unable to, we're, when you're out of your problems, you can see so far ahead of you in the distance of where you're going and you get excited. When you're in your problems, the, the scope comes real close, everything gets dark, you can't see tomorrow, what tomorrow might bring, and then that's when you get into, it starts to affect your soul, it starts to affect you on a deep level. So overwhelm, it happens to everybody, but I want you to remember that we ride cycles in life. It's always darkest before the dawn, and it sounds like, you know, you've heard this before and blah, 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 but in reality, it is so true. I've never found it, when, you, when, it, when you're looking at the year, let's take a look at a year, uh, throughout 365 days. At about J December 21st, December 20th, you go outside, in the north anyways, you go outside and it's about four, at about four, 4.30, it's dark, real dark. But after that, it starts to lighten up. You see, it can't, nature can't skip that, it has to go that way. And in June, around June 20 odd, it also gets 9, 30, 10 at night, sometimes you can have light. Again, cycles in life, and so is our, our problems. We will go through those ups and downs, but what you gotta do is realize that, that you will come out of it. Because you, if you're listening to this, you have met, you've had many problems before and you've managed to ride it and come out of it. So don't get overwhelmed, don't, don't go deep into your problems, just, and we'll continue. Give some more I wanna share with you. All right, we are energy. All right, so whatever problems you're in, remember that the old quote, we are energy beings having a human experience, and it's so true. Because when you think about this skin suit, this thing we're in, this, this can age. This can break down on you. This body of ours does change over time. But in reality, your subconscious mind, your soul is timeless. Think about something that happened to you when you were five, and now you're 50. 15, 25, 35, whatever it is. But that thing that happened to you when you were very young, you can relive it almost like it's today. And that proves that, and you have all the feelings, all the emotions, you have everything like as if it was happening today. And that proves that we are timeless in our minds. And this is, again, this is just a physical body because we live in this physical world and we manipulate the physical world. We, we can sometimes get fooled and think that what we see is what we get and this is all there is to it. But in reality, my belief system is your soul. It's that thing that talks to you. It's that thing that make you hopeful. It's that thing that can nurture you. Your soul is in there and it's timeless. So you have to protect it. Don't, when you get overwhelmed, it starts to get heavy on that soul. So avoid overwhelm. All right, action steps. Accept your situation, but don't become it. All right, so here's the deal. 
I might not have any money in the bank, but I am not poor. I am not poor. My situation isn't what I wanted. The money might not be in the bank, but I am not poor. I might have made a mistake in school or made an error in, in something, but I'm not stupid. The situation, I can fix it, but I am not stupid, you're not stupid. There's so many situations. I, I did an event and I lost. I am not a loser. I lost the event and I can change that with my next time that when I practice and correct that event. Whatever it is, you might have had a business loss, but you are not the loser. Business losses happen because you made an error in judgment and you maybe not have planned, but you can start again and do it again. So again, don't become your situation. It, it's just an event in time and over time you've had many events, some good, some not so good. Again, don't become it. You can experience it, but don't become it. All right, watch your labels. Watch how you're labeling yourself. Your words have power, okay? When you say something to yourself, it, it means so much to you because it's, it's coming from, you can't speak without it coming from your subconscious mind and your mind. It's, it begins, your mind, what it's, this is the seed. And when you speak, it comes out and it becomes real. So be careful of what you consistently repeat and say. Sometimes you, it gets so bad that you can't even catch yourself saying it. But I want you, this is where journaling comes in. And this is where having a accountability partner or a coach comes in to get you to watch your language, watch how you're labeling yourself. Again, you are not the loser. You are not stupid. You didn't, you lost the competition, but you are not the loser. Okay, you are not poor. You are not stupid. You, you are not a bad person, okay? Things happen, so watch your labels, all right? So that's, that all has an effect on the soul, and when you can rid yourself of all that, you can start to see the light at the end of the tunnel, you can start to feel lighter, and you, your soul is, won't be as heavy. All right, so let's re review. Overwhelmed, be careful of being overwhelmed. And that comes from just not be becoming the situation, as we talked about. And remember, your energy, everything that happens to you and you let it seep down, it weighs down your energy and it starts to affect you mentally, emotionally, physically, spiritually, and all that. So we are energy. This is just a skin suit. Again, it's action plan. You can be in the situation, but don't become it. And watch how you're labeling yourself. So this is Alvin Brown. This is Soulful Saturday. Thanks for joining me. Subscribe and watch for some of our online courses coming at you. I'm working on those. I want to add value. This is my passion. This is my goal forever. And my team and I, we work to help our clients achieve optimal health, peak performance, and to pursue their personal greatness. And that's what we do. If you want to get in contact with us, our, our contact information, visit our website, www.tchpp.com, journeytopersonalgreatness.com, our phone numbers will be scrolling along the bottom, 905-420-4325. We also do online coaching, Skype, with, with technology. I can get to wherever you are and we can connect. All right, until next time, be relentless in your pursuit for personal greatness.